Yes? Oh, it's... nothing. It's fine. You... you really can tell that there is something else. Looks like I can't hide it from you any longer. Or else, you'll just keep pestering me about it until my soul slivers up to Cold Harbor. But... I don't even know if you'll forgive me after this. I'm really sorry. Do you remember when you first met me back at Dim Hollow Crypt? Did you ever ask yourself why you were so calm when you first saw me? You were a vampire hunter. While you were new to the Order, you still accepted that as your creed. Otherwise, you wouldn't have slayed every single vampire that my father sent. Then... Why didn't you kill me? I just looked like any other vampire in that cave. Maybe a bit more attractive, but you get the point. Being a trained vampire hunter, your first instinct would be to draw your blade and attack. You would have slain me then and there, taken the scroll, and fled. But you didn't. You were so calm, because... I casted a calm spell on you. Look, you were the first person I saw after being locked up for thousands of years. And you were armed to the teeth. I wasn't exactly mind-controlling you, but I did mess with your head, deceiving you without your consent. I know I complain about my family, and how I wasn't able to choose my own path and my own decisions. It turns out, though, I'm not that different compared to them. I'm just a hypocrite. I didn't even believe in myself enough, or believe in the trust I talk about. I was merely a vulnerable girl, doing whatever she could to get what... No, I didn't even want anything back then. I didn't even know what I was thinking. There were so many thoughts rushing through my head, and I just... I manipulated you. I really just wanted to survive, then and there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for hiding this, all this time. If you want to leave me now, it's fine. If I were you, I probably would. Wh what Oh. Then, why didn't you tell me sooner? Well, I'm glad those other events came along. If our first meeting wasn't that genuine, with each of us trying to trick the other, I'm glad that the rest of our experiences were, at least. But I realize, if we keep on keeping secrets like this, our relationship is bound for destruction. Thank you for being honest with me, and I hope you'll forgive me for this. <laughs> I really am a fusspot. I'm supposed to be strong, irreverent, cynical. But you just do know how to bring up this tender part of me. <laughs> <laughs>